First word, mommy or daddy? daddy. Mommy. Daddy. <laughs> hey guys, really quick, we just filmed this video in the park. When we started, there was a woman who was doing yoga on the basketball court right behind us. So we were a little awkward. At least I was a little awkward and feeling like shy in the beginning doing a YouTube video interrupting this woman's yoga practice. So that's why we're a little low energy in the beginning. But this video was so, so fun to make. We came to the park because it was like 60 degrees today. It was gorgeous out. It just seemed like a perfect day to be in the park. And it seemed like a perfect day in the park. So that's where we went. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are doing a fun version of this or that, but it's a baby edition because one of you guys asked for it and we think it's the most adorable thing ever. So Adam's coming on this fun video. Ready? Sure. Cool or strict parent? Ooh. I'm definitely the stricter parent. <laughs> 100%. Well, let me, let me say this because if it's a girl, uh, it's definitely going to be daddy's little girl. Without and, a doubt. And I am going to be totally wrapped around her finger. However, if it's a boy, I I think I'm still, I'm obviously, I'm still going to be on the more lenient side. But I think there's going to be a little bit more structure. It's going to be different. I'm definitely going to handle the two differently, no doubt. I'm going to be the stricter parent. But then again, they always yeah. say that you're not what you necessarily think that you're going to be. Like, my sister was always like, I'm going to be so strict. My kids are going to have the strictest routine. Da -da -da. Her kids are. Walk all over her. <laughs> <laughs> but, but listen, it's, you know why that's going to be? It's going to be me saying, go ask your mother. They'll be like, come on, dad. No, go ask your mom. So, sorry, but I'm, I'm going to put that on you. I'm telling, I told you I'm gonna I'm be the telling, strict one. I'm telling you now, yeah. So you'll get to be the strict one. Change diapers or gag? Who's changing more diapers? Oh, I'll change diapers all day. I mean, we I think we're both changing a lot of diapers. Yeah, no problem. Spoil baby versus save for baby. Who's spoiling the baby more? Spoiling versus save for baby? What do you mean, save for baby? Are you spending all your money because you're spoiling the baby? Or are you saving your money and kind of being frugal when the baby's a baby so you could have like a college fund? Mm, we're gonna do both. We're gonna spoil the baby and we are going to definitely put money into a college savings account, 529. We were just talking about that earlier. So yeah, we're gonna do both. That's right, we want it all. And baby's gonna have it all. I mean, we know how great I am at saving. I'm gonna be the spoiler. <laughs> sleep all night or wake up all night? Who will sleep more? <laughs> I, I don't think there's any competition there. I am the sleeper of the relationship. However, I want to breastfeed, so we'll do a lot of pumping. Yeah, we'll. Fi I mean, we'll figure it out. <laughs> I'm laughing. Like, like every other couple does, right? You figure it out. I sleep. That's my biggest fear with this baby. I sleep so much. You sleep a lot, but I'm sure you'll make the adjustment. And for me, you know, I need my sleep. I need seven and a half hours. That's what I need. I need nine and a half hours. Not kidding. Well, it's about to change. We know. You don't have to tell us in the comments. We'll figure it out. Eat healthy or allow sugar and crap food. Who will cave first? I will definitely cave first. <laughs> yeah. We yeah. want to feed the baby as healthy as possible. We both eat very healthy. But if you're asking, if you feel like we had to choose one, 100% I'm gonna cave first. I guess, unless it's a little girl. No. And she's wrapped around your finger. No. No, there are certain non-negotiables. That's one of them. I mean, right. there are certain things that absolutely not. But if you're asking who's caving first, it's me. Help with school or help with sports? Who will help with more of what? Mm. I'm gonna- I know you're not helping with math homework. I was just gonna say, but I'm also, I'll be a sports mom, but I don't understand sports so much. Oh, I mean, listen, whatever sports they choose or whatever activities, I mean, even if it's something we're not familiar with, but we're going to learn it. You know what I mean? Sure. True. We'll, we'll watch True. a YouTube video and, uh, pick it and figure that out. I would too. say both on that one. Well, but if it's math homework, I'm sorry. I just, <clears throat> I will teach you wrong. And I'm not really a good math teacher. Like, my math is not 
great. We'll have like, to keep O'Malley on speed dial. Exactly. Yeah. You better know a good tutor, and thankfully, we know a couple of them. Clean the house or go to the park. <laughs> I'm the park um, person. <laughs> I don't mind cleaning. I don't mind cleaning either. I'm just, if when I'm exhausted, yeah. that's when it becomes a problem. But if you had to choose to, to leave a messy house, because it's a beautiful day, to take the baby to the park, or oh, we're going to, to the clean park. the house. Yeah, that's the question. Yeah, we're going to the park. Going to the park. Ooh, this is a good one. Give advice or show by example? Mm, Both. Uh, yeah. Both, I'm, but you I'm, have to lead by example. You can't say, do as I say, not as I do, or you can't teach by do as I say, exactly. not as I do, or you're going to make children who resent you. Yeah, there's no room for hypocrisy. That's one thing I despise. And to be honest, one of the things, like, like as a kid, any adult, any parental figure or authority figure who was like, because I said so. Like, to me that was never, that's not an adequate answer. I'm gonna make sure that whenever there's something that needs to be explained, like, I'm gonna explain it. But what happens if you have a kid that's like, why? And then you answer and they're like, but why? And then you answer and then they're we like, go but why? as far down that road as we And then it's 35 go. minutes later and you're late for work. Like, there's gonna have to be a point where you're like, just, that's it, because. No, there's no because. How many babies have you been with? And toddlers. <laughs> Not many. I mean, and that's great. Like, this this is our first. Listen, we might come back to this video one day and, uh, you know, laugh at you it. You are allowed to make laugh comments myself, about that in the comments. You can laugh at me too. But, uh, yeah, there, listen, there are certain things that I'm, I'm, holding, I'm holding fast. First word, mommy or daddy? daddy. Mommy. Daddy. <laughs> It'll be dad to have because it's easier to say, but uh, oh, they'll be don't, looking at Don't mommy. throw in that disclaimer. No, it's true. <laughs> it's true. Uh, Mama's baby or daddy's? Obviously, you already answered that one. Mm, yep. Which is so unfair because mom's always like the drill sergeant. Mom has to say the rules, da, 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 da. but mom has to go through all the BS in the beginning with her body and the nausea. Life is just unfair. Yeah, true. It's not fair, but you know, it's just how it is. Oh no, you didn't. Will you be the house all the friends come to? Of course. Yeah, most absolutely. Definitely. Breastfeed or formula? Breast. All day. Yeah. Absolutely. God willing. Yeah. Will they look more like me or more like you? I hope they look like you. My hope is that they are a perfect combination of both of our better qualities as we each see them. Very diplomatic, very well said. Like I said, I just want the best for our for our little baby. Reveal the name before or after the baby's born. After, in my opinion. That's entirely up to you, whatever you want to do. You gotta keep some things a surprise and we're gonna tell everybody the gender, so. YouTube family or hide the baby? YouTube family. Yeah. Yeah. Strict routine or go with the flow? <laughs> I feel like famous last words would be strict routine, but. Uh, I would say a flexible routine. What's that? What are we talking about here? Strict routine or go with the flow. For who? The baby. Um, are you keeping them on a rigid, like very strict, non-bendable routine? Or are you just like, meh, go with the flow? Ideally, I would like to have a, a set routine and us try and stick to that as much as possible. Right. Because based on everyone that we've been speaking to as far as you know, initially getting the baby on a good sleep schedule and those things, as difficult as that may be, you know, to, to hold firm initially, especially when the baby's crying and you want so bad to just, you know, comfort the baby. And there are times where you're like, Ugh, you gotta let them cry it out a little bit and, you know, get on that schedule. I'm hoping that, that we can keep to that routine as much as possible. But yeah, absolutely, we're not gonna be super rigid like you gotta be flexible with anything and the reason i say a flexible routine app uh, routine <laughs> routine is because absolutely i am 100 percent that baby needs a routine for their sake for our sakes etc however i say flexible because i 
had parents who had, they were more on the like less routine side because there were just so many of us, but I can sleep anywhere. I can sleep with the light on, with the light off, with noise, without noise, and I will sleep through the night. And I think that's because there were times if my parents were out at night, they didn't say, oh my God, it's 7.55, I have to get home, the baby has to go to bed, I have to stop my whole life. And I'm not saying that that's a bad thing, but that's not necessarily the best thing. And my sister was saying that one of her employees who's, 18 to 20 years old their parents had such a strict routine and they always had a noise machine on that literally she melts she melts if there is not background noise she was trying to do a transaction one time and the music went out and she literally my sister said she just watched her spiral and she could not think she couldn't compute it was just like she needed control alt delete at that point to be reset and after the person left because my sister kind of hopped in and finished the transaction for her she said i'm sorry i'm just so used to having background noise my parents had a sound machine all the time and she goes on vacation and if there's no sound machine like she spazzes she tries to use her phone there was no wi-fi one time they had to leave vacation the first night because it was it's like that so that's what i'm saying flexible because baby needs to kind of learn how to be flexible yeah yeah what <laughs> water birth or hospital birth I, i'm all about the water birth but you know it's not me it's not me <laughs> oh. first of all <laughs> i told him to look up ring of fire which i don't think he ever did I however no i have one word epidural I have three words, epidural, epidural. And number two, my age with my high risk, I have to be in a hospital. I do not like doctors, I don't like drugs, I don't like any of that stuff unless it's absolutely necessary and it is absolutely necessary. The end. All right, that's what <laughs> no. we're gonna, we're gonna no, have no, to no. wrap this up. Yeah, chunky baby or skinny tiny baby? <sighs> it doesn't matter, chunky babies, skinny Chunky baby. babies are so cute We're gonna love them either way. <laughs> calm or panicked during labor? Please calm. I'm gonna try and be calm. God bless us all. All right, we love you guys, gotta go. That was fun. It started to get dark. Kids started to come to the park, so we came into the car to finish this video. If you're not already subscribed, you can do so by clicking that little circle there, you're out of breath I am, or the red box below. To watch our pregnancy announcement video, click that video right there. We love you guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Mwah.